Ramadan. So in this Ramadan, I'm going to be telling you guys about all the great things. So uh, happy Ramadan, and I hope you guys are doing well. So of course, of course, of course, Ramadan has came to us, and we all know that we love Ramadan so, so much that, you know, we want to speak about it and speak about what is in it. So what is Ramadan? Ramadan is one of the months, it's one of the moon months uh, in a moon year. So what happens in Ramadan? In Ramadan, all of the demons get just all rallied up. So there's nothing that can make you do something bad. If you do something bad, it's all on you. Why is it the fact that we have to fast in Ramadan? Uh, before that, I just want to tell you guys to hit the like button and subscribe if you're not already. Hit that bell notification, you know, the notification bell so you can get notified whenever I post any new videos. Alright, so I come back to the question. Why do we Muslims, all 1.8 billion of us and more, why do we all, why do we all fast in Ramadan? Well, except for the people who are sick and the people who are traveling, but since COVID, I uh, don't think anybody's going to be traveling. So, what are we doing here in Ramadan? We are fasting. Why? Because God tells us in many, many parts of Quran that fasting, is, we have to do it. Because like it was, you know, uh, told to the people before us to fast, we must fast like them. Because we're human and they're human. So we do the same thing. And first of all, think about it. Fasting is not eating and it's not drinking. It's no eating, no drinking, and no, no, no doing any bad deeds too. From sunrise to sunset. Now think about it. You'll be like, man, I'm going to die if I don't eat. I'm going to die if I don't drink. But it's not that really. The fact that so many scientists prove that <clears throat> fasting, this this year so-called fasting, which is not eating and not, you know, drinking, whatever you think of it, it's not having any source of anything like you can eat and you can absorb and your body can, you know, digest. Anything that you put in your mouth. You can't do that. You can't put anything in your mouth. Okay. So, you may think, as I said, that it's bad, but so many scientists, so be it, many scientists have proven that when you fast, as soon as you, like, start fasting and everything, there are so many good things about fasting. And as God says in part 184 of Surah Al-Baqarah, So, it does say that, Sadaqallahu alayhi of course, God peace, God peace of fasting, of so many things, of so many good things. Because number one, the best thing that anybody generally wants to get out, rid of is bad habits. Now, fasting means that, number one, you will not like, want to do bad habits. Because you're always thinking, oh man, I don't have food, oh man, I don't have, uh, you know, water. Um, and I don't have nutrition. But have you ever thought of the fact that you're actually now being in the less fortunate people's place? Now, according to so many researches, so many less fortunate people don't eat for a long time either. But our prophet tells us that if you knew the actual quality, the level of quality of Ramadan, you would wish it was for the whole entire year. So Ramadan is something very, very important, and it's something that us Muslims like really love. One thing is, it's very fun fasting. It may give you headaches sometimes, but it actually doesn't. It doesn't give you anything. It you're not going to get hurt. Actually, in Lil Qadr, which is the night filled with mercy and hope and basically will and everything, that day... Well, we don't know if it's for certain, but they say that it's in the 10 last days of Ramadan, and it's on an odd number, so 21, 23, 25, 27, 29. Uh -huh. So it's on the odd number in the last 10 days of Ramadan. They've precised it to that much. They don't know if it's in the top 5, top 3, 
Last three, last five. So basically, in that day, the person like they, the person feels so like amazing. They feel so good and muscly. They feel so great to the fact that they don't feel like they're fasting. And some science research uh, in you know China, <clears throat> some science research proves that it's actually true. For once, they had a person fast, and it was not on, you know, what was destined to be Lady Qadr. And then they had another person fast. Well, they're both non-Muslims. So, and they had another person fast on the day that was supposedly destined to be um, Lady Qadr. So, they've seen that this person feels a lot better than this person. And he feels more great. This person has nothing wrong with him, but this person feels more power. And they realize that it's actually true. So, um, back to my question. Why do we fast Ramadan? It's because when you fast Ramadan, you get lots of great things. You stop your habits and you get a feel of what the poor and less fortunate. Sorry, I didn't mean poor. I mean less fortunate. You get a feel of what they feel like. You get to stop your bad habits. And best of all, is that your body is great. Because, you know, lots of scientists also say that it stops lots of illnesses. Like, there's many things. Like, if you have poisoned food, poisoned not in the literal matter, poisoned as in filled with germs. If you've ever got a poisoned belly or something, not eating it helps that a lot. And belly aches and all that stuff, not eating and then slowly having a piece of fruit with milk or with a bin, which is cow milk but chunky. It's not chunky milk, no, that's, that's kind of gross. But anywho, so they show that Ramadan is actually a great year. Oh, we wish it was a great year because we wish Ramadan was all year, but Ramadan's a great month. Because also the Qadr is better than a thousand months of good do of good deeds. So that's why people are so happy that Ramadan comes so they can redeem themselves. You know, not everybody is secure from the demons. But thank God, in Ramadan, there ain't no demon, there ain't no nothing. So uh, that's why we fast. The reason why we fast in Ramadan is so simple. It's the fact that God says that it's good and it was proven by many others. I'll see you guys in the next episode, and uh, yeah.